Hey guys, Angel of Death TV here, casting the 2015 World Championship in English. It has already passed, this is not a live cast. We're currently in the round of 16. This is group C out of four groups. The next group is group D. This is match one. There are two matches in this group. This match is Taiwanese player Lu Ting Chen playing Summoner versus the Japanese Blade Master Koichi Hirota. Off the opener, the blade hunter goes straight in, but looks like he stuns the cat instead of the blade ma or instead of the summoner. He gets his days on the summoner, however, and goes into an air combo. Goes for the knockdown to stun the cat on the side. Big damage on the summoner so far. Sunflower's coming out. The cat's in a defensive curl. True friend is finally used by the summoner to get some heal some health back. Blade just comes with a five point strike. Goes for the air combo. Goes for the knockdown again to CC the cat. Knocks down the cat, but the cat gets out of it. Cat goes for its own knockdown, and the Blade Dancer gets it, but he F-rolls out of it. The Summoner used their retreat. Their true friend is almost up, so they're going to be healing pretty sh uh, pretty shortly. The Blade Dancer has their abilities up, their escapes up. Goes for the knockdown. Is there a Blade? Yep, there's a Lightning Draw coming out. No Blade Draw follow-up, though. He has his invulnerability frames up, but he's uh, trying to keep it at a range, it appears. The Cat charges the Blade Dancer. Doesn't seem to pin him down. Stun coming out on the Summoner. Didn't get the air combo. Cat's back in a defensive curl. True Friend will be off quote on momentarily. Phantom Grip on the Summoner. Air combo coming in. Goes for the... Cat tries to interrupt it. Doesn't manage to. Knockdown stuns the Cat. Cat gets out of it. Dazes the... Dazes the Blade Dancer and goes for the Suppress. The summoner... Er, Blade Dancer then Tab escapes out of it. Trying to keep pressure on the Summoner, but the Summoner's gotten... Seems like the Summoner's chasing the Blade Dancer now. Blade Dancer's trying to get some time for some cooldowns and such. Probably waiting for his, uh, his tab escape. Goes for the Blitz Blade uh, guard break, but isn't able to. Isn't able to land it. Lightning draw comes out. Looks like it didn't hit the summoner, or if it did, he wasn't uh, he wasn't on the ground, so it wasn't a guaranteed crit. Days onto the summoner from the blade dancer. Doesn't seem to get a combo out of it. Cat puts down a mine, knocks down the blade dancer. Cat's at a, a little above half HP, but he's regening health in his defensive curl. Summoner's getting health back from stealing it from the Blade Dancer. Blade Dancer goes into the 5-point strike, but the Summoner immunes it with his 5-iframe uh, his five iframe defensive ability. Phantom Grip catches the Summoner. Gets the Soul Blade mark. Does the Soul Blade... Uh, I don't even know what to call it. The Flock of Soul Blades, we're going to call it for now. It's a lot of... Long dot. Does a good bit of damage. Looks like the Blade Dancer put a put a bit of hurt on the cat, but didn't do too much because the cat went into defensive curl. But it looks like he used his lightning draw on the cat there. Summoner healed up off the cat, however. True Friend is back up, so he can heal again if he needs to. The Summoner's in a really nice spot right now. Blade Dancer's at about half, and he's not looking too healthy. His uh, his tab escape is down. He got a he got a fan grip on the Summoner, pulled him away from the cat. He got the stun, goes for the knockdown. He still has his flock of blades, he hasn't used that yet. His invulnerability frames ability he uses, goes for the 5 point strike. Lightning draw, wasn't on a knockdown but got good damage off of it anyway. Goes for the uh, blade draw follow up and time runs out. Did the blade dancer do enough damage? Because summoners are known for having a ton of healing. 72,000 from both of them. Who did more? Blade dancer did do more damage so he wins this match with a 90,000 damage dealt. Both of these classes healed an incredible amount that game, considering the average health pool is uh, about 45,000 for these classes. Blade Dancer used his, uh, his lightning draw there a lot of the times when there was the knockdown, so he could have gotten more damage out of it, but... Even though, like, but he did enough damage, so I guess it didn't wind up hurting him. Like, there was the first knockdown and lightning draw that he used. He used his, um, his air combo. He went into the knockdown and knocked down the summoner and the cat. And I think that was the first time he used his... First and maybe only time he used his lightning draw on a already knocked down character. The reason that is important is because it does additional damage and is a guaranteed crit for Blade Dancers on a knocked down character, or a knocked down target. This is the uh, the end combo there where he does lightning draw into a good handful of blade draws. He gets some range to try to reduce damage knowing the time's gonna run out. Didn't really, wasn't really necessary as he was uh, that far ahead in damage anyway, but obviously it's not something you know in the game until afterwards. <laughs>
<laughs> Summoned a lot of healing, and uh, didn't really use suppression with his cap too much. Although I'm pretty sure it looks like the uh, summoner might have the flock of blades to break it. I don't know if these or the players might have flock of blades to flock of blades to break out of it. The summoner still didn't force it to really happen. The flock of blades cooldown is really powerful, especially um, especially when used in tandem with his uh, soul blade mark into the soul blade dot that he that the blade dancer can apply to the summoner if he gets him in a phantom grip. The cat was actually, now I'm thinking about it, the cat from the summoner was actually really elusive in escaping CC because he was in every knockdown that the, the Blade Dancer did. The Blade Dancer did an air combo and a knockdown, which is pretty standard when you're playing against the summoner to knock down the summoner and the cat. The cat really responded almost immediately. It didn't even really seem like it was knocked down. Good health management by the summoner as well, because he kept the uh, the healing abilities on the cat going so that he could keep draining its health. We're gonna see how this next game, this next set opens up here. Summoner goes for the summoner stops the blade dancer's uh, charge, but the blade dancer pops his invulnerability frames and gets a lightning draw for huge damage. Air combo from the summoner's cat. Five point strike gets the daze, but no knock up. Knock down on the summoner. Draw stance, blade draw coming out. He's got the. Summoner Phantom Grips drains the Chi and drops him down for a knockdown, tries to get some damage out of it, but the Summoner backs up. The summoner gets a giant heal from the cat with true friendship. Blade Dancer looks like he's trying to get some range there. He goes for the knockdown, but the Summoner mute summoner counters it and gets a stealth. Sunflower spam coming off from the Summoner here. Looks like we got a stun on the Blade Dancer, but he comes out of it and gets a Phantom Grip on the Summoner. Doing some chi damage. Pops in vulnerability comes out of it. Knocks down the summoner and blade draws. Immediately doing some follow up. Uh, sorry, does lightning draw. Immediately following up a blade draw for some big damage, but it gets healed immediately by true friendship. The summoner's tab is down, so this is a good time any to get another big combo if the blade dancer is able to. Blade dancer's tab escape is down himself, so he has to be careful, however. Phantom grips the uh, summoner and gets some distance. <laughs> the summoner still has the cat's pounce and suppression. Cat's doing some uh, some disruption there, getting a little bit of healing done as well. Invulnerability frames and lightning draw come out from the blade dancer. He goes for a phantom grip, but the summoner uh, uses their backstab double S and evades it. Air combo from the Blade Dancer. He doesn't follow up with a knockdown or anything. Looks like he was targeting the cat by accident. Gets a second knockup. The cat gets in the way and starts targeting yet again. Knockdown in the summoner. He's trying to keep him CC, just doing a basic ground combo now. The flock of blades out of the suppression from the cat. Cat goes into defensive curl. Cat's looking pretty healthy, so there's another true French appeal coming out momentarily as it comes off cooldown, I imagine. Summoner gets some range, immediately true friendship heals. Lightning draw comes out, does some return damage, but doesn't nearly do enough to to answer for the help that was just uh, just regened. Summoner backstep, their tab escape is down. Blade Dancer's not looking so healthy though comparatively to the summoner. Summoner's cat is very healthy, and that means the summoner has a, a large pool of health to draw from. He gets a big heal just from his abilities, and he has true friendship up to heal again. He heals with true friendship while he's in the air. Blade Dancer does the knockdown. Lightning draws almost up for another big damage combo. He needs to get something really big with this if he's gonna get back in this game. His health is incredibly low comparatively. He uses his iframes and the summoner attacks into it a bit, gets some gets some health back. Huge combo on the summoner, he knocks him down in his uh, in his AoE, gets some huge blade draws after that, completely chunking the summoner. Throws down the summoner, but time runs out. It's another match going to be decided by who did the most damage. Blade Dancer wins yet again, pulling out a, another approximate 30k more damage than the Summoner. Was getting hairy at the end, if he wouldn't have done all that damage in the end there, he might not have been so far ahead, might have been a lot closer. And uh, if he didn't stay alive, it wouldn't have mattered how much more damage he did. The summoner made the mistake at the end though, when the blade dancer was really low, the blade dancer popped his immunity, his iframes, and when the summoner attacked into it, 
it healed him on cast. It healed the Blade Dancer on cast, and then every time the summoner attacked him, which was like two hits, I think, before he realized, just due to reaction and travel time, uh, those two hits hit the Blade Dancer after his immunity was up, and he got an additional 2-3% heal off of those two hits. Which definitely helped him survive damage at the end there. But uh, most of his combos were just lightning draw and a, a single blade draw, it looks like, up until the end where he got a, a huge lightning draw into maybe four or five blade draws for the majority of the summoner's health pool. Incredible damage right there, brought the cat down to half as well. True friendship would still have been used, but it might have uh, might have made the cat a more, more reliable target at that point if the game had gone on. New York fan in the crowd. Keep an eye on him. That's shady. Blade Inch is doing a good job of just keeping keeping alive because Summoner can stay alive very well with their with their heals from the cat, but uh if they don't do enough damage they just uh they just lose. So once it comes to the point where he knows he's done enough damage and done more damage, he still needs to keep trading, but he needs to stay alive. Definitely needs to prioritize not dying over everything else at that point. Going into set 3 here, this could be a 3-0 for the Blade Dancer over the Summoner. We're going to see how this opener goes, because the first set 1, the Blade Dancer got the charge off. Set 2, he did not get the charge off. He was stopped in the air. We're going to see how this third set goes for the opener. Character spawning in. Blade Dancer jumps up, does not... He does get the charge, but he hits the cat instead. The cat was already in defensive position, doesn't do any damage to it. Gets lightning draw on the summoner immediately. Huge damage coming out for a good opener. Nice chunk of his health, not as much as uh, we saw him end the game out with last time, but a good chunk for an opener. Phantom Grip onto the summoner from the Blade Dancer. Stealing some chi. Throws him into the wall. Backs up, goes for the 5 point strike. Gets the air combo. Chooses to go for the knockdown and not ascend. Cat comes in range, but... Uh, defensive curls the knockdown not to get affected by it. Summoner used their counter there, but decided to keep uh, chasing the Blade Dancer. Knockdown onto the cat, or knockdown onto the Blade Dancer attempted. Blade Dancer knocks down the cat there. Phantom grips the Summoner again. Pulls him away from the cat. Cat tries to keep up. Immunity frames coming out from the Blade Dancer. Big heals coming in because the cat is still attacking. Summoner gets a nice heal, true friendship from the cat. Big damage onto the cat from the Blade Dancer. He just chose to put his uh, draw, his lightning draw and draw stance onto that. But the cat is in a defensive curl, regenerating a huge portion of the health. Days onto the Blade Dancer, doesn't stick. Summoner tries to have the cat suppress the Blade Dancer. Blade Dancer tab escapes out of it. Cat is in a defensive curl, not regenerating health currently. But uh, is there with full health again, so true and friendship can be used. Phantom Grip onto the Summoner, puts him down in the corner, knockdown onto the Blade Dancer. He returns the knockdown, there's a Mine down, however, he's gonna get knocked down when the cat gets up. Mine doesn't go off. Mine was never detonated. Blade Dancer's trying to spin around to get an attack on the Summoner instead of the cat. Cat's disrupting targeting, cat goes into a defensive roll, or defensive uh, curl. Looks like he's healing up a little bit, the cat that is. Blade Dancer's taking some big damage there. He grips the phantom. He grips the summoner and throws them away. He's putting damage on the cat because he's the only one nearby right now. Looks like the Blade Dancer's taking a nice chunk of damage. Summoner's still relatively healthy and so is his cat. Blade Dancer's spinning and there's 50 seconds left. Huge heal on the Blade Dancer from the uh, immunity frames and getting damaged by the cat at the same time. He sent out Lightning Drop but didn't get too much from it. The summoner, if the Blade Dancer can survive, we can see if he does enough damage, did enough damage this round. There wasn't as many huge combos as before, or Blade Draw uses, so it might actually be going to the summoner. He throws the summoner down in the corner, goes for the spin, knockdown. Backs off, how, backs off however, Cat goes into defensive roll. True Friendship is up, probably going to be used shortly. True Friendship is used. 20 seconds in the clock. Let, he, the uh, Blade Dancer will get one more Lightning Draw, he needs to make it a good one. Make sure he gets ahead in this damage. Phantom Grip, throws him down, immunity, lightning draw, big combo, puts the damage on the cat however, damage onto the cat doesn't count as damage done overall. Days from the summoner, summoner doesn't look too confident that he won that one. Maybe he doesn't think he did enough damage, we'll find out, numbers are coming up now. 
3-0 from the summoner. Uh, yeah, 3-0 from the blade dancer. My my apologies. 3-0 from the blade dancer. He didn't make it. He didn't uh, clear the gap by three by 30k this time. He was only about maybe 8 9k ahead of the summoner, but he did manage to edge this one out. All three matches going to timeout and relying on uh, relying on damage done because of both these classes ability to sustain. Summoner ended both games at a very high health pool, but did not do enough damage because he was playing defensively and healing. Didn't do enough damage to kill the Blade Dancer, which is basically all he could have done if he wasn't going to do enough damage to out-damage him. But uh, he wasn't able to do that, so looks like the Blade Dancer takes this 